Yeah. I feel like those two are doing really well together. Improved so much. We have like a lot of new girls on our team this year. Some actually like ninth graders who are still in middle school playing against a bunch of 12th graders and they're doing really well and our team's improved so much. The BC Peace ladies dropped the game 38 to nothing in the end but had a lot of encouraging plays. They started um, clicking a little bit um, after we got scored on twice. It was just kind of that regular Peace rugby. We just wake up and then we start playing. Um, Bax had a few real good breaks. Uh, Jenna Decker um, had some, a couple of real nice kicks that got us some yardage. A size difference in the rosters and in physicality really helped PWA to the win. The home side borrowed a few players from the visitors so they could play a full 15-a-side game. Peace Wapiti Academy carries a roster of 28 with them, while Dawson and FSJ has significantly less, resulting in a lot of running. These ladies here today played the whole game, um, so there was no substitutions, and they all fared really, really well. And the Grand Prairie side, an older team, had a size advantage both on offense and defense. Unfortunately, they were um, quite good at running through tackles um, and scoring on us. It's kind of like hitting a wall <laughs> most of the time. The girls seem to have a good grip on the rules in their first 15s game this season, but got pushed around a bit in the scrums. Something that's expected to improve with time. That's experience. Uh, we, we've been practicing with five forwards, and that's what we have. Um, and when you start throwing three more into the mix, it makes it a little bit different. The ladies' next game is on Wednesday when they host Sexsmith Secondary School. They'll look to take the game to their opponent in that one. Definitely being more aggressive and really going for the tackles. There's been quite a few rucks where we just kind of step back and kind of let them take over, but we really have to push through those and just not be afraid. Derek Lightfoot, CJDC TV Sports, Dawson Creek.